What's up everybody, welcome to Money Management Channel. My name is Andre and today I'm gonna to be doing analysis on Terra Luna Classic. And on today's video, first of all, I will show you where we are on the price chart and how we get there. I have to say that this asset uh, went from uh, its lowest point uh, right here to its highest point uh, in a matter of just uh, 20 days and it gained about 612%. And I will show you is it possible to catch another leg to the upside in order to gain some money. Then I will continue with the fundamental news. I will show you why this asset is skyrocketing right now. And at the end of this video, I will share my thoughts and my technical analysis. And I will show you the precise uh, path of this asset uh, for the next uh, couple of weeks. So let's continue with the price chart. As you can see, this asset, uh, as I already mentioned, gained about uh, 600% uh, and uh, for now it has uh, some kind of retracement. And uh, definitely we have uh, several uh, major peaks. As you can see, if you take a look on the MACD indicator, you can see first one is right here at the very beginning of September. Second one is right here on September the 6th and the third one is right here on September the 8th. And definitely this structure might be the five wave structure. We have, this is our first wave, second, third, fourth, and fifth. And I have to say that uh, uh, we have uh, this uh, the third wave uh, almost the same length as the first one, but uh, it is not uh, the shortest. And this means we are not violating any of uh, Elliott wave, wave theory rules. And also we don't have an overlapping uh, of the fourth wave on the territory of the first one. This means this uh, movement uh, to the upside uh, is uh, basically from the technical standpoint is almost perfect. So, and right here we also have uh, this small tip and on a slightly bigger scale we have this is our first wave, this is our second, this entire five wave structure is the third wave. We are seeking the bottom of the fourth wave on a greater scale in order to probably hit some higher targets. And definitely this uh, movement uh, will be quite uh, expectable, but we have to be very cautious with upcoming days. So, what should we expect next from the technical standpoint, I will show you just in several minutes. And for now, let's continue with the total sentiment of the crypto market. First of all, as you can see, uh, we are sitting at $1.05 trillion of total market cap. It is a 2.63% increase over the last day. And uh, on a seven days period, all the major cryptocurrencies are in green. Bitcoin gained about 7.57%, uh, Ethereum gained almost 11%, and BNB gained about 6.43%. Uh, so, let me show you the data for Terra, Terra uh, Luna Classic. As you can see, uh, it has a total market cap for now at uh, 2.73 billion dollars. It is a 14.93% decrease over the last day. And the total tradable volume is 2.72 billion dollars as well. And uh, uh, as you can see, it uh, lost about 19.7% of its value. I have to say that uh, because of uh, this uh, very low price, it is 0 0.0004438, you can uh, assume that it has a very high circulating supply and it is very high as you can see it is 6.151 trillion coins and it is a huge huge number definitely we should see some decrease in its uh, number in order to see higher price targets so uh, why this asset is skyrocketing let me show you uh, right here it is uh, the uh, basically the table of uh, the most uh, trending, uh, biggest gainers, biggest loser, losers and uh, most visited uh, coins. And as you can see, we have uh, several coins with the Terra word in uh, its uh, name and it is Terra right here, Terra right here, Terra Classic that are our target, that is our target right now, is right here among biggest uh, losers. Then we have the most visited uh, coins also Terra Classic, it is on the first place above the Bitcoin, then uh, Terra right here. And uh, definitely this is a quite uh, popular coin and let me show you another data. On uh, stocktweets.com website you can see the most active, you can see basically the rankings of uh, certain assets and uh, Terra Luna Classic is on the second place uh, in the most active uh, section. In the trending section Terra Luna Classic uh, we don't have it, we have uh, just uh, Luna uh, 2.0. 
Next one, on the uh, watchers section we have Luna 2.0 on the first place and uh, Terra Luna Classic on the eighth place. This means a lot of people might even be confused about these two coins and some of them might enter their position with uh, the asset that they don't want to do. But it is what it is and uh, you have to be very cautious with these uh, names. So, and uh, let's continue with the technical analysis, but before we dive deep right here, please subscribe to my channel, hit notification bell and hit the like button. This helps me a lot. So guys, let me show you that uh, we completed five wave structure in the inside the third wave, if it is uh, the real third wave. And if I pull the Fibonacci uh, retracement tool from its lowest point, from the bottom of the wave to the top of the wave, as you can see, we almost hit the 0.5 Fibonacci retracement level and had a very good bounce to the upside. And uh, you might know that uh, the retracement should have a shape of uh, simple zigzag, at least this type of uh, uh, shape. And uh, in this case, uh, we should uh, have some kind of movement to the upside in order to, com in order to complete the top of our B wave. And then we should see lower price targets in order to complete uh, the entire correction and in order to complete the bottom of the C wave. Uh, in this case, uh, you have to be very cautious because uh, for now we might see the movement to the upside that might hit uh, some higher targets. Uh, it shouldn't break the top of our fifth wave right here at the price point of uh, 0 0.00059321. And if I pull the Fibonacci retracement tool from this top to this bottom, we have several levels that uh, might hold and uh, from which we might have a trend reversal. Uh, for now, we are hovering almost uh, at the 0.382 Fibonacci uh, retracement level and it is the confluence with the top of our third wave right here, internal third wave. And uh, it is also first range of resistance. Second one is 0.5 at the price point of 0.0047774 and the most probable range where we might have uh, a trend reversal in order to complete like this, in order to complete the top of our C wave in order to complete the top of our B wave, sorry, and to uh, then uh, to have a rollover to complete the C wave, is right here. It is a golden pocket range, the range in between 0 0.3050499 and 0 0.3051238. So, we might hit even this range and then we should have a rollover. And that's why you have to be very cautious, because uh, the upside potential for now, depending on where we might have this trend reversal, might be 8.68%. Uh, if we will break the 0.382 level where we are now. And uh, the next range might be at roughly 16% uh, of potential profits. But the downside potential for this asset is quite massive. Depending on the price section, we might land at the next range of support right here at the bottom or at the top of uh, these two waves uh, of the second wave of the retracement. And it might be up to 31% all the way up to 50% of potential losses. That's why you have to be very cautious and, in my opinion, just uh, stay aside uh, from this asset if you don't uh, know where it might land. Uh, otherwise, uh, just uh, enter your cautious position in order to uh, have the next leg to the upside. Keep in mind that uh, we might have this rollover anytime soon and uh, this rollover definitely, let me show you on a, a daily time frame, as you can see, we have very, very high RSI with uh, bearish divergence. We have uh, lower highs on RSI with higher highs on the price section. And this means uh, if uh, this uh, range of uh, 70 points breaks, definitely we will see much lower price targets. And in this case, uh, we will land the bottom of our C wave much deeper. That's why you have to be very cautious. So, I think from the technical standpoint that's it for now. If you like my video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel with notification bell. And see you guys and girls next time. Bye! I got the cash in the bag, stadium pack Born a rock star in this life, gone live it up on the attack Baby, I'm bad, I just wanna get caught up in this life